I'm just sitting there kind of like, uh... Ahmad Najam had no idea that this video he shared on social media would lead to an internal affairs investigation of a 16-year veteran SEPTA police officer. The cops told me to get off the train. He's like, no, I'm not going to get off the train, this, this, that. They were cursing back and forth at each other. SEPTA police were attempting to remove 20-year-old Ellis Smith from the Market Frankfurt L Thursday evening. He boarded the train with a little girl in his arms at the Margaret in Oxford station when a cashier reported seeing him evading the fare and jumping on the train. Moments later, at the next stop, a SEPTA police officer confronts him and tries to persuade him to get off the train, produce identification, and accept a citation. The point of contact to the point where handcuffs are placed on, on the person is uh, 14 minutes long. The heated verbal exchange between the two became physical, all the while the child is caught in the middle. Where the officer pushes him up, he's still holding the child. Another rider, you'll see the other rider heads over to try to take the child. The father um, doesn't release the child. Backup later arrives, and Ahmad Najam's video captures the tense moments on the platform, describing a crying little girl still in the arms of her father. People was offering, even offering to pay for him, like, here is 225, here's a token. It was just too much. There was no need for, uh, like, the escalation. We can't endanger the lives of, of little kids <laughs> over a fare evasion. That's... That's unacceptable, and that's on me. SEPTA Police Chief Thomas Nestel is calling for better training of his officers in situations like this. This is the type of incident that causes us to, to reflect on, on what we tell our police officers and how we tell it. Najam has no regrets about capturing the video, hoping it becomes a teachable moment. It's not really a matter of, you know, brutality of police, but it's a matter of, like, how a situation should be handled. This definitely was something that shouldn't be handled in that way. Community activists are calling for the immediate removal of the officer involved. He has not been suspended, but an internal affairs investigation is currently underway. At SEPTA headquarters, Natasha Brown, CBS3 Eyewitness News.